Hello and welcome to Quick Tips, the WordPress video series. In this video, I'm going to install a plugin which will help you translate your website in 85 different languages. So it is a WordPress multilingual plugin. I'll show you how to install the plugin and how you can translate your website into different languages. If your website has global presence and it is seen in many different countries, then this plugin is going to help you a lot. Let me show you an example. Here I have installed this plugin on one of my websites and in the bottom right hand corner you will see the option to translate the website. The basic language of this website is English. So I'm going to click on it and you will see different options here. You can customize this option. There are 85 different language options that you can use. I have selected some of these options here. You can customize the button also. You can place it in the bottom right hand corner or bottom left hand corner, top right or top left corner. Let's see, I want to translate this website into German language. So I can click on German language and you will see that it is going to translate the website instantly in a German language. It works really fast. If I want to change it into Spanish language, I can select Spanish and you will see the Spanish language here. Let's say I want to change it in Hindi language. So I can select Hindi and you will see the entire website in Hindi language. Now we have this button here. You can also add the button in the main menu bar. You will see it here. So if I click on it, I can change it. Let's say I want to change it into French language. So it is going to change the language of your website. Let's go to one of the blog page here. And you will see that it is also translated into the French language. It works really fast. Let's change it in Hindi. You will see the entire blog post is translated into Hindi language. So this will be very useful for your audience in different countries. Let's go to Chinese. You will see the Chinese language also. Awesome. Let's go back to English. Now let me show you the website of this plugin. The website of the plugin is Lingwiz. Translate your website into over 85 languages with unlimited instant translation. If you use good translation plugin, I'm sure that you will also see increase in the traffic from the search engines. Now it is not a free plugin. However, you can go for one month free trial. So you can use this plugin for a month and see the results on your website. If you see increase in the web traffic or if you see the decrease in the bounce rate, then you can definitely continue with the paid plan. And it is not only for the WordPress, it can be integrated on many different platforms such as WordPress, Shopify, Squarespace, Webflow, Wix, Joomla and for the other CMS integration is available. Let me show you the pricing. You will see three different plans here. The startup plan will cost you $165 per year in which you can translate up to 200,000 words and unlimited translated page views, unlimited languages. And if you go for the pro plan, it will cost you $275 per year in which you can translate up to 600,000 words. And in the last plan, you can translate unlimited words, unlimited translated page views and unlimited languages. I have created a free account here. I'm testing this plugin using a free account. You will also get a live editor where you can change the wordings using the live editor. So I'll show you how you can install this plugin and how you can translate your website into 85 different languages. So let's see how does this work. Do not forget to subscribe to Quick Tips YouTube channel. Watch new videos about website design, e-commerce websites, search engine optimization, social media marketing, WordPress tutorials, video editing tips and many more. Press the bell icon to get instant notification whenever we publish new videos. So here I'm logged into the dashboard of the WordPress website. So let's go to plugins and click on add new plugin. The name of the plugin is Lingwiz. So search for Lingwiz. And this is the plugin automatic multilingual translation. So click on install now and click on activate. The plugin is installed and in the left hand panel, you will see the option here, Lingwiz, click on it. All right, so first we will need to create an account. We will need to register for an account. All right, so click on this option here, register an account. And you can log in with your Google account or you can log in with your Microsoft account or you can create account manually. So I'm going to create account manually. So you can enter your name, email address. And you can create one password here. 
and click on submit so it is so simple you just need to enter the name email address and password and your account will be ready all right so this is your account you need to enter the domain of your website so i'm going to copy the domain and i'm going to paste it here platform this is a wordpress website and you will see different platforms are there wordpress shopify squarespace webflow zoomla opencart so all these platforms are available so we are going to select wordpress all right after platform you will see the language option this is the language of your website the current language the website is created in english language so we need to select english and next option is translation languages so you need to select the languages in which you want to translate this website so by default you will see some languages are selected chinese spanish french german russian you can add multiple languages i'm going to add hindi so if you want you can delete some of these options so if you do not want chinese you can delete chinese and you can add any other option next option is translate urls so i'm going to select no click next step install the wordpress plugin we have already installed the plugin and this is the api key that we will need so i'm going to copy this api key go back to the dashboard of the wordpress website and enter the api key here click apply and you will see the changes here you will see translate your website into these languages all right now we have add language switcher automatically these are the options language list display now let's go to the website and let's refresh the website let me refresh it and now you will see the option here english so this is the option where you can click and change the language let's select german and it is going to translate the website into the german language all right so you will see it is translated i'm not familiar with the german language let me translate it into hindi language and you will see it is translated you can also change the words in the translation i'll show you how to change the words you will see it is translated into the hindi language so people from india can also read this website in hindi language let me go to one of the blog post here let's go to this blog post and you will see that the post is also translated into the hindi language so if i go through the content i can see that it is translated pretty good now if i want to change it i can again change it let's go to russian language and this is in russian language let's go to chinese all right so this is in chinese let's go to spanish and it is translated into spanish within a fraction of seconds so this is working pretty good now we can customize this icon here in the bottom right hand corner you can go to the settings you can change the flag here we have the option bottom right hand corner top left top right bottom left bottom right so these are the options to show the button the language selection button here and this is actually using a pop-up so instead of pop-up we can use a drop down like this you will see the option here or side by side if i select side by side it is it will be like this so we need to save the settings here let's go back to website and refresh it and you'll see all the options in the side by side it will stay there in the bottom right hand corner you can change the position and next to that we have flag language name or short name so if i go here you will see the flag and then the language name if you want you can also use short name instead of the language name save it refresh it and this is how it will look all right so i'm going to use pop-up and language name now next to that we have language display name for english this is english around how do you want the flag style around or rectangular you will see a round flag here and english type english flag type usa flag german flag type then spanish flag type so these are all customization settings you can go through these settings these are pretty simple settings this is the size of the flag language color name you will see the color name is in black you can change that you can change the color language 
hover color if I change it to yellow let's change it to somewhat red all right so I'm going to save the settings here and let's refresh it move the cursor on it you will see the change in the color now let's see how we can add the language option into the main menu let's go to the dashboard go to appearance go to menus and in the menus you will see the option is added here linguist languages select it add to menu and click on save menu let's go back refresh it and you will see the option is added here so you can customize you can change the color settings of this one if i click on it you will see the pop-up again so i can select the language so you will see two different options to change the language this is in the main menu bar and this is in the bottom right hand corner now let's go back to the dashboard of the linguist.com and at the top you will see domain list so this is the list of domains here we have one domain already added if i go to the domain you will see the statistics of your website we have 59,000 characters and translated words are 10,000. So you will see all the statistics of your website, how many languages are used. It says you're currently using 9.5K words out of 600K words included in the free trial. And the free trial is available for one month. We are using the free trial here. If your website has global presence, then I'll suggest you to go for this plugin. If I go to website, you will see all the integration. It is not only for the WordPress. It is compatible with many different platforms. Translate more for less update translation instantly. Yes, it is updating the translation instantly. You will see it here translations from here you can select the language so it will show the translation for that particular language here you will see free consultation is written like this if you want to change it you can simply click on it and from here you can change that particular word and once done you can click on save you also have live editor option if i click on it it will go to the live editor click on open live editor it will go to your website and it will open the live editor on your website so i'm going to select hindi click on translate and you will see the option here live editor option so if i want to change it i can click on it edition mode is there so i want to let's say i want to change this i can click on it and from here i can change it once done you can save it this one is about pricing. If I click on it, I want to change the wording. I can go to that. It says see pricing and I do not want this word here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to delete this word and save it. And you will see that change is done here. So you can also use the live editor and you can change the content according to your requirements. So it is super easy and it is super fast and you can translate your website into 85 different languages and another benefit is that you can use the trial on several website domains here you will see that yes the trial can be used for each new domain register even if you have several domains under the same user account so i'll suggest you go for one month free trial see how does this work on your website translate your website in different languages if you see benefits you can definitely go for the paid plan so that's it for now see you in the next video do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools if you have any questions please leave us message in comment section and press the like button if you like the video thanks for watching quick tips